I'm Ashleen Delaney, the Social Work Lead here at the Northern Ireland Hospice and I'm here to talk about Dying Matters Awareness Week. There are many taboos and stigmas around discussing death, dying and grief, which is why this year's Dying Matters is focused on the way we talk about dying matters. Starting these conversations may seem very difficult, but it's the first step in getting all the information and support you need, which will help to make the most of the time you will have together. So we need to normalise having honest, open and timely conversations about death to make sense of a difficult situation and to have good quality end of life care. You will then feel empowered to make the choices that are right for you and your loved ones at the most vulnerable time of your life. There are many things to talk about, such as what type of care would you like? Where would you like to be when you die? Would you like to be cared for at home, in hospital, in a hospice? What kind of funeral would you like? What are the details of your will? Who will care for any dependents you have? How would you like to be remembered? Is there anything you want people to know before you die? And are there any limits to how you would like to be treated? An honest conversation will help to get things organised and let those closest to us know your wishes. Advanced planning and preparation can give relief and allow us to better cope with the emotional and practical impact of death. Because the way we talk about dying matters. It really does. If you need more information and helpful tips for talking about dying, visit our website, nihospice.org slash dying matters.